No Film School's coverage of NAB is brought to you by Black Magic Design, amazing solutions for film, post-production, and television. My Road Reel, the world's largest short film competition, is back. Shutterstock, your source for stunning HD and 4K footage, plus high-quality music. Hey, what's up? I'm Ryan with No Film School. We're here with Francois at Sony. We're talking about taking the F55, the existing camera, up in terms of its features and frame rates with the new R7 recorder. So uh, this new unit that you see on the back of the camera here, what is new with that? Thank you, Ryan. Good question. This is our new AXSR7. It will be replacing the AXSR5. This brings the camera to a completely new level. New camera now. Traditionally, if you want to do 4K 120p, you had to look at our flagship F65 camera. A beautiful an older camera, camera, but... It is an older camera, but it was so ahead of its time. What we needed to do with the F55, and the F55 finds its way a lot in the episodic television. It's a smaller form factor. It does not take as much data to transmit that information to the XSR5. So the XSR7, that new version, brings it to 4K 120p. What was the frame rate capped at with the previous recorder? With the previous recorder, we're limited to 60 frames per second, 60p, 4K 60p. Now with the new recorder, we can go to 4K 120p. In addition to that, based on the voice of the customer, we had a functionality called cache recording. So we can do a 30 seconds cache recording. So if you were to do, let's say, in a news environment, a press event, and you don't know when the presenter is going to come in, the camera could be recording on the cache, and you have 30 seconds to stand up, go press the record button, and you haven't missed a shot. One thing we did is we changed the uh, loading mechanism instead of being on the top it's on the side and it lets us do a recorder that is weatherproof so the weatherproof does prove a much more robust design we have a bracket to also support it on the top of the camera so even though we're keeping the same physical size we were able to give them to give the operator a much more sturdy system raw is easier to manage than a compressed format so when looking at set xavc which is extremely efficient codec that we use in the broadcast environment because not every broadcaster can move file in the gigabits per second. It's easier to go with a compressed format like the XAVC, which is an extremely efficient workflow. It is an efficient codec that we developed at Sony with a profile and level that is taking advantage of all the tools in the MPEG-4 spectrum. When we look at RAW, what we're doing is we don't have compression. What we're doing is we're taking a file that is picture-based, and that's why your computer doesn't have to do decompression or uh, process it, so it's much easier to handle in most post-production system. Uh, the ID and this is, this is new media that requires that you require for these, these data rates? Absolutely. To be able to do that 4K 120p, we're also introducing a new line of media that has twice the speed, so we can handle that extra bandwidth of double the frame rate from 60p to 120p. So new media that will fit here. We can also accept the old media and discard, so the second generation AXS media will fit here, but will be limited to 4K 60p. Pricing has not been released. It's going to be in time for the summer for the production season. So we have not released the exact date, but it's going to come in for the summer. If someone has the previous recorder, is there any sort of swap ability that they have, a, a discount, anything in that realm? We are reviewing program. We have not disclosed that. We are always looking at the voice of the customer, and we will present the product as it comes out with the pricing and programs available to it. Okay, so new uh, Sony F55 features coming via the, the external recorder this summer. Thanks, Francois. My pleasure.